Hidden below the pontoons at Conwy Marina in North Wales, a vital restoration project is slowly taking shape beneath the surface of the water. Each pot contains an oyster nursery. The goal, here and at other locations around the country, repopulate a once thriving UK species, which has seen numbers fall by 95%. We have a really exciting opportunity in all these locations because we've got so much habitat to restore. We've got a big ambitious kind of road ahead. So this is just the first stage of the project. Once they're in the water and the water temperatures start to rise to around 16 to 18 degrees, then they'll start to release larvae and reproduce and release their larvae. That larvae will then be carried out, out to sea and then hopefully try and help us to restore those native oyster populations. The humble oyster is a small but perfectly formed, environmentally friendly machine, filtering out pollutants from seawater, improving the ocean waves for everyone. So here's a fascinating fact for you to hold on to until your next pub quiz, whenever that might be. A single oyster can filter up to 200 litres of water every day. These oysters being cleaned and prepped for the rewilding project are from a fishery in Scotland. Once destined to be served up on a plate, they now have a higher purpose in life. Quite a few people, when you mention that you're working on oysters, think of sort of oyster bars and glass of champagne and how, how delicious they are. However, in the ocean, they provide clean water and also a space and a habitat that's protecting other species and also increasing biodiversity. There's clearly a lot to do, so time to get on with it. Back into the water for these ocean superheroes, quietly busying themselves, being brilliant. Peter Lane, 5 News, Conwy.